हेलो एवरी वन ग्रीटिंग्स फ्रॉम इलाइट एडीसी डिजाइन प्राइवेट लिमिटेड एंड वेलकम टू आवर चैनल इलाइट टेक कैड एंड ऑटोमोटिव डिजाइन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट सम मेजर कैड सॉफ्टवेयर यूज इन दी मैकेनिकल डिजाइन इंडस्ट्री स्पेशली इन ऑटोमोटिव एरोस्पेस एंड सम स्टार्टअप एंड स्मॉल केयर इंडस्ट्रीज Uh, some home appliances companies medical equipments and industrial products so mostly the mechanical engineering students or automobile engineering students or production engineering students uh, and the freshers uh, they have a one question in mind which software should i choose my design software so this video is to just clear uh, your all confusions your all myths and just to let you know the overall idea about uh, the Uh, major CAD softwares used in this industry. There are number of CAD softwares used of, uh, in many industries for different purposes, but in this video we will see only major CAD softwares which are used in this mechanical industry. If you see this table, uh, in this table I have uh, explained in very detail. So if you go to the uh, first column. you can see the there are number of softwares used so in the second column i have mentioned like uh, the range of the softwares the high end software or high range software or the low range software and if you go with these softwares how your career will be after 5 years what would be your salary and which companies are used uh, using these softwares so first of all we will start with uh, like the high range softwares like katia v5 ugnx and creo so these are some high range softwares uh, mostly used by mnc's automotive companies and aerospace industries if you choose these softwares as your design software so your career growth will be very exponential <clears throat> once you start your career with these uh, softwares approximately after 5 years your salary will be somewhere around uh, 7 lakh to 10 lakhs per year okay so now we will see the some low range softwares there are number of softwares as i said earlier uh, like solid works solid edge inventor autocad and so many softwares so we will not go in depth about the low range softwares uh, so those softwares uh, uh, basically used for uh, used by the startups and small scale industries home appliances companies medical equipments and uh, so many industrial pro uh, products the other thing uh, why these startup and small scale industries uses these softwares because of its cost the high range uh, the cost of the high range softwares is very high so startup and small scale industries uh, cannot afford the that price and also their requirements are not that uh, that high range requirements need uh, the high range softwares for their uh, projects vice versa Uh, the high range softwares like ketia unigraphics and creo these are the very costly softwares most mnc's automotive companies and aerospace uh, companies they prefer to use ketia unigraphics and creo for different domains why because uh, they specifically they need to work on the surfacing the surfacing capabilities of the ketia and unigraphics are very good and the creo software is mostly used for the uh, chassis engine and the transmission uh, domain the bottom line is uh, more than 90% of automotive companies and their suppliers use ketia v5 due to its user friendly capabilities and control over surfacing this is what in short about the major cad softwares now we will see next mechanical cad software is best nothing and absolutely nothing beats ketia in surfacing but the way ketia gives control over the surfacing is beyond par even ugnx takes a back seat considering this a uh, lots of companies still i continue to use ketia such as a tata motors honda motors johnson controls ti automotive ford and many more oems so friends uh, if you see why the most automotive companies uses ketia v5 the main thing is that the surfacing capabilities of the ketia v5 are very very excellent okay you have a very good control over the surfacing basically the automotive and aerospace companies the aerodynamics is the factor which is mostly considered ju just to cope up with the air drag and also uh, to improve um, the fuel efficiency and all those things so we need to work on the 
surfacing mostly the exterior styling surface so the katia software is very good even ugnx take a back seat that means ugnx is also very good in surfacing but the the surfacing can be done very good in a good way in the uh, katia now we have so many low range softwares but in this video we will see the comparison between solidworks and the katia there is there is nothing like good or bad both softwares are used in product design and developed by Dassault system as the name itself suggests solid work is good for solid modeling capabilities and used in startup and small industries so friends uh, i just wanted to let you know the Dassault system of uh, france company it has developed the katia software basically uh, for the, uh, their own projects uh, in the aerospace industry so the bottom line of this video if you want your career to grow exponentially then you should go with high-end softwares so what will happen if you go with high-end softwares you will get a long-term career growth with major automotive companies worldwide such as such as tata honda jcb Siemens, etc if you choose high-end CAD softwares like Katia, UGNX as a design software and on the other hand if you choose the low-end design software as your design softwares uh, then you have to start with the small companies with low salary and with the linear growth but yes that doesn't mean that you cannot uh, switch to the high-end softwares uh, start uh, you, if you want to make the entry in the design field yes you can always uh, enter in this design field with any CAD software like like SOLIDWORKS and other softwares and eventually if you want uh, you want you, you can shift in the automotive domain aerospace domain if you talk about the domains and if you want the exponential growth so the your growth will be very exponential in automotive domain only so what will happen uh, once you start your career in the automotive industry with uh, high-end softwares uh, in automotive domain so for initial couple of years you will work uh, in india for uh, big companies like as i said earlier tata honda and etc after gaining some good and versatile experience you can go to the uh, some other countries also like usa uk germany france because they are also uh, having the automotive hub over there so you will get a chance to go uh, out of india you will get the exponential growth in your career so my suggestion is to always prefer to go with higher end softwares and if you want the exponential growth always you should prefer automotive field and you should have the design and domain knowledge in the uh, automotive field like the different domains you should only uh, we have seen uh, in some of our videos that uh, having the only knowledge about CAD software is not enough to get the entry in the design field along with the CAD softwares like ATI Unigraphics you should have the domain knowledge also like BIW, Plastic, CAD Citrix Systems etc. If you feel the information in this video is useful for you uh, then please uh, like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel Facebook page that is Eli Tech CAD and Automotive Design Hub Actually we have a very good library of uh, videos on CATIA and Automotive Design so please uh, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon so that you will get the notification about the latest videos Thank you We will meet again with some new exciting video uh, shortly uh, generally we upload uh, three videos in a week stay connected be positive and utilize your the lockdown time to enhance your design skills and take them to the next level